Come on, Gatorade. I know you got me, buddy. This is gonna be a nice one, 74. Boom, caught it. I called that, baby. All right, guys, we'll go back somewhere. I'm going to be in innings 24. And so in this one, I'm going to be upgrading the new Gatorade and Justin Turner Team Sigs we got in the last pack opening. And so all we needed was a third baseman Team Sig to replace Boggs. We got Justin Turner 16, one of his best years. And then also, we only need bullpen guys and a good starting pitcher like Scherzer 21 to replace Tant. And we'll have a full team of Team Sigs. So both of the guys we pulled in the last pack opening were useful and we ended up pulling Gatorade as a diamond from the special TSS and both options were a diamond. If you haven't checked out that video, go watch it. It's in the top left hand corner. And so I'll be making Justin Turner a diamond a day with the GI ticket and then I'll make both guys a black diamond. We'll try and get skills on them and then we'll also special train and put trainers on them today. And so without further ado, let's go ahead and get this thing started. So first things first, we're going to make Justin Turner a diamond. He's already a gold, so we're just going to use this GI right here. Obviously, Gatorade is already a diamond, so we don't need to do this. Saved us our GI. Not going to complain about that. Boom, there we go. Newest diamond on the team. Justin Turner, 16. Let's see what his GI is going to be here. Are we going to get cheesed, or is it going to actually be pretty good here? And a 61. We got cheese pretty hard right there. So GI reset ticket coming right up. And let's just go ahead and do that. It's a 61. It can't get much lower. All it can go is down one. So if it goes down one, our luck is just brutal today. And so this is going to be a success. Can this be a really good one? Give him like a 75 right here. What, what would the chances of that be? And it went up one to 62. <laughs> Bruh. Oh, I'm loving the trolling. Honestly, with the luck we had, though, getting two diamonds from the same special TSS pack, I don't expect to have any luck in this one. I think it was all used in that pack opening on Thursday. Let's just go ahead and use the next GR reset ticket on him, and hopefully it doesn't go down. It's a 62. It can only go down two. It's going to be a success. Is this going to be a 63 right here? Please don't. 68. You know what? Better than nothing. And so that leaves me with one overall amp ticket left. And so Gatorade also has a 68 GI and Gatorade's going to go in before Justin Turner because Justin Turner has to get a really good set to replace Boggs. So we're going to use the overall amp ticket on him and hopefully we can get him into at least the 70s, like 71, 72. Come on, Gatorade. I know you got me, buddy. This is going to be a nice one. 74. Boom. Caught it. I called that, baby. Let's go. He's one short of 75, but that was a success right there. So now that both of them are diamonds, let's go ahead and make them both black diamonds. We got 507 black diamond pieces back here. First things first, let's do Justin Turner to start, and then we'll finish off with the best for last Gatorade, who's actually going to go into the bullpen, hopefully, after we get some skills today. And there's our first black diamond today. And boom, there we go. Justin Turner, 16, now a black diamond. Next up, last but not least, Gatorade. It's time to make him a black diamond right here. 160 black diamond pieces and boom, second of the day. And I'm hoping we can get one of the new skills on him as well. So we got some new skills. We'll talk about those in just a second. But there we go. Gatorade is now a black diamond as well. And so before I go and use premium skill change tickets, greens and blues on these guys as well, we got some new skills added to the game in the last update. We got a legend batter skill, hard hitter. We got two gold skills, super sub and strength in the strength and a silver skill overcome weakness. And then for pitchers, we got a new legend skill called workhorse. And then we also got two no gold skills, elite closer and ground baller. And then a silver skill called pace setter. And finally, in this update, we got some improvements to existing skills. Clean up your mess was made better, apparently, and put away pitch. And I never use put away pitch. I don't know if it got much better, but a lot of you guys have been saying that cleaning up your mess got a big buff in this one, and I might have to try and use that again. And also for these new skills, I haven't gotten any of them or used any of them yet, and we're going to probably stick with them if we get them in this video and test them out. But with them being brand new, I haven't got to try them, so I have no clue what the meta is with these yet. But I have heard that the workhorse skill is not that great with it, only pretty much affecting stamina. So we'll see how that works. And let me know what you guys think of these new skills and... Uh, what the meta is if you already have these skills in there because obviously i've not gotten these yet on this account or the angels account to really test out so now let's go ahead and use some premium skill change tickets on these guys and i'm gonna be starting with my bullpen sig gatorade because he's more important we need bullpen guys we already have boggs the legend at third base so turner has to get a really good set to replace him not as much of a need as the bullpen is right now and so let's start with gatorade like i said there he is and let's open the second slot real quick see what we get here and nothing there, no new skills. But first things first, let's go ahead and roll on this first set since it's not that good. No set, either set is really good, but let's see. Let's just go on the first one. And we did get an Elite Closer, so we saw Elite Closer on the first skill change ticket today. 
That's one of the new skills. I'll take that, but it's a low-level set, and we're not going to keep it. And I guess we'll go ahead and roll on the second skill slot now for number two. How many will it take to see a Legend skill today? We got 31. I'm hoping we can save some for Justin Turner. And there's Elite Closer again. We pulled that back-to-back -back now. Can third time be a charm right here? And Legend skill, Pitcher's Insight, and we'll take it. But Pitcher's Insight is not as much of a buff from the last update as Batter's Insight was. It's not as good as we thought, so we'll keep that, but we'll keep rolling on the first set. The luck has seemed to dry up. And as soon as I say that, we get another one, but it's slow starter, not a high level set either. Slow starter would be decent for a middle reliever, but besides that, it's not useful in the bullpen. I mean, I'll take that. That's just not gonna cut it. We did get elite closer though with it again, so. Another legend skill, slow starter again, one, one, one. Man, come on, just give me bullpen day. Got 10 left, man, I'm starting to lose hope. Another legend skill, workhorse three. So we got one of the new legend skills. But sadly from what I've heard, Warcourse is not that great of a legend skill with an affecting stamina, especially on a bullpen guy. So I'm actually gonna stick with this first set over it. We pulled a new legend skill, but I don't think that's really gonna benefit us on a closing pitcher or a bullpen guy like Gatorade. Come on, bullpen day right here. Bullpen day, 3-1-1. Gosh, it's a low level set though. I called bullpen day. But you know what? I'll take that. I'll take that over the other one. If we had to stick with this, we'll just grain it and get another gold, good gold skill for now. It won't be end game, but I'll take bullpen day. Last one before we get the accumulated awards. Another one, pitcher's chemistry, which actually, that's not bad. We'll keep that in the second slot for now because eventually this card might go to be our last relief pitcher for pitcher's chemistry. Down to our last premium skill change ticket today. Can we get one more legend skill? Last premium skill change ticket luck. And no, it's going to be a gold. And that's going to do it. We're going to have to just probably green this set for now. And try to get a higher level end game set down the road. And we won't even be able to touch Justin Turner's set today, sadly. So let's go ahead and use some normal greens on that Gatorade set so we can at least use him in the bullpen for now. He's not going to be top of the line, but if we can get another good gold skill with bullpen day, he'll be at least usable. But here we go. First try. Let's try and get um, Elite Closer maybe with it. And we can at least try that out. And we got Finesse Pitcher, so we'll keep that. Next up, it's time to special train Gatorade. And we're not going to work on Justin Turner the rest of the day because we couldn't use any premiums on him because Gatorade used all of them. And so we're just going to work on him down the road. Eventually, he'll replace Boggs if we get a good set, but there's nothing to do with him for now. And so let's see how high we can special train him today. So with all the cards we had left over from the last pack opening and XP items, we were able to get him to level 8 out of 10. So he won't be max on special training, but he does have diamond skills. And then he just has two more levels to be able to max him out. All right, so now I'm going to put some trainers on him, and then we'll put him in the bullpen, and that'll be it for the day. And so let's go ahead and find him right there. Boom. And so we're going to give him a special trainer to start. And we're going to go with Dr. K since he'll get plus two break as a relief pitcher. Go ahead and register that. And there we go. Special trainer done. And with fastball being so low on this train right now, we'll give him some fastball, but this will probably change once we go back and retrain him. So I'm going to give him this one right here, plus one location, plus one velo, plus four fastball. It gives him also plus one location as a relief pitcher, which he will be. So there's one, and then we just need to get another plus four fastball to at least get him to 100. That's the goal. And I'm going to go with this one right here. Plus two location, plus one stamina, and plus five fastball, and then also plus one stamina if he's a relief pitcher, which he is. And there we go. So he now has 100 plus fastball. And at the moment, he currently does have the finesse pitcher bonus. Plus five more to location and break over velo and fastball on the dot. Okay, let's go ahead and put Gatorade into the bullpen. And so we're going to replace Phillips. Obviously, we're keeping McGee because he currently has pitchers chem. Gatorade does, but we're going to use Gatorade to actually pitch for us. And we'll put him in front of Kuo. But we'll keep him behind Blake because obviously his set is not there yet, only being a lower level set. And I'll move my camera real quick for you guys to see the final product right there. Obviously, we got another special training level to go that'll give him some more stats. And then we get to the 10, he'll be able to have the level 8 on Finesse Pitcher. But that is the card, and we are now finished. And actually, we'll be finished after we max his skill set right here. And there you have it. His skill set is maxed. We got Finesse Pitcher to Diamond. Yo, I just went through my inventory again at the end of this video, and I realized that I had a legendary skill change ticket. I totally overlooked it. 
So let's just go ahead and use this on Gatorade and see if we can get a higher level set. Already got him in the bullpen. We'll roll it right here because we have pitchers chemistry in their slot. Can it be high level and what's it going to be? And yeah, no, it's low level with Crawford of pitching, so it didn't make a difference, guys. But I'm sure some of you guys would have seen that in there and said, why didn't you use it? And it's because I totally didn't see it. But as you can see, we got cheese on another legendary skill change ticket. Normally gives us not good skills. And if it is a good skill, it's low level every single time. And so now that should do it for this one. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did, go ahead and leave a like, subscribe, and said. I'll see you guys next time.